Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to make the Rod of Vandis. To make the Rod of Vandis, you're going to need to have completed a large majority of the in aid of the Q quest. The items needed are a silver bar, a mithril bar, a cut sapphire, a rod clay mold, and if you don't have this anymore, I'll show you how to make it. One cosmic rune, one water rune, so you can cast level 1 enchant, which requires 7 magic. One rope, and a teleport to a furnace. I'll be using the port Adamus furnace. And teleports back to Canifus, such as a Krill teleport, if you have one. And if you still need to make the rod clay mold, you're going to need to bring one soft clay. And if you are still working on the innate of the Maricu quest, also bring a hammer. Alright, so to start off, I'm going to build the rod clay mold. So make your way to Canifus and head south of the Hair of the Dog pub to this dungeon icon. There, we're going to make the rod clay mold. So enter the trapdoor. And now run south and search the wall. If you are still working on the in aid of the Mary Q quest, use your hammer on the boards right here. But I've already completed the quest, so I can go in right away. Head south and then east to Evandus's tomb. On the tomb, use your soft clay. To create a rod clay mold. Now teleport to any furnace you'd like. I'm going to stay in the area by teleporting to Port Fatimus's furnace. And here I'll be making the Sylph Thrill Rod, which will eventually become the Rod of Vandis. And if you're still working on the Innate of the Mary Quest, I would suggest making two rods of Vandis, as you'll need one for a later quest. So go ahead and smelt on the furnace with the items in your inventory. And select the Sylph Thrill Rod, which does require 25 crafting. And now with the enchant spells in your inventory, go ahead and cast level 1 enchant on the Sylph Thrill Rod. Next, teleport back to Canifus, or make your way back to Canifus the best you can. Make sure you have a rope in your inventory, and we are going to head to Drizzle, to the west. So make your way back here, and keep running west until you get to the Paterdomus Temple. Open the trapdoor to go to the basement of the Paterdomus Temple. Climb down. Run past Drezzle. And go to the main area where there is this well. And use the Sif Sif throw Rod on the well. And you'll get it back, and it'll become the Rod of Avandus. I hope you found this video useful, and as always, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more.